Hello, my name is Elizabeth Cobb, and this summer I worked under Dr. Angelica Angles studying geomorphic features within Terra Cyrenum Mars. The Terra Cyrenum region can provide a unique insight into past hydraulic processes that can better constrain Martian hydrologic cycling. This region holds a diversity of geomorphic characteristics that potentially indicate the past presence of acidic and saline waters, including paleolake basins, channels, and indicative evaporite and phyllosilicate deposits. These terrains were largely influenced by its widespread extent of liquid water that experienced periods of wet-dry cycling and hydrothermal activity, driving acidic saline geochemical processes. Here, I use high-rise and CRISM data from Google Earth to investigate these indicative features within Terra Cyrenum to better constrain geological context, morphological characteristics, and spatial distribution. Within the heavily cratered southern highlands, lacustrine environments typically form in depressions and shallow basins that are fed by channels and create inverted reliefs. As these depressions are filled with water and then subjected to desiccating conditions, it creates increasingly acidic and saline solutions, imprinting them within the environment. It is widely accepted in literature that Mars experienced a shift from its near-neutral surface waters towards an increasingly acidic state by the early Hesperian period, 2.7 to 3.9 billion years ago. Pool channels, basins, and other areas of sanding water would have been particularly influenced by this shift in pH and deposited aqueous alteration minerals in the forms of phyllosilicate clays and salts such as chlorides and sulfates. In the features I examined, there is evidence for channels, paleolake basins, ridge lines, and mineral deposits that indicate a lacustrine environment. By comparing these features with modern acid saline systems in Western Australia, and utilizing remote sensing mineralogical data from literature, I found striking similarities between them and my features. This would indicate that the features I observed preserved acid saline environments that would hold clues to Mars's hydrogeologic history and geomorphic evolution.